A Gloversville teenager is facing charges tonight after police say he cut down nearly 20 trees at the high school that were planted in remembrance of the deceased or had been given to the school by graduating classes. Craig Smith is live in Gloversville tonight with that story. Craig, fill us in on what's been going on. I, I think we can see them behind you there. Yeah, we'll give you a closer look in a second, Liz. Evidently, this is somebody's idea of a joke, sort of a senior prank, according to the principal. But the senior class certainly is not claiming responsibility, and most people here don't seem to be laughing about it. Now, right here is just one example of the kind of crime that got this teenager in trouble. A young man, really. He's 18 years old. It's one of 17 trees that were cut down on school property. It was quite a different scene for school employees who came here this morning, saw it right off the bat. As Liz mentioned, these were planted in memory of students who've passed away, and others were gifts from one graduating class or another over the years. The person police arrested is 18-year-old Curtis Callen. He's a student here, a senior who's now been suspended for five days. The principal says the surveillance video shows the crime happening this morning around 3 o'clock. And Callen was locked up on $5,000 bail. Police say the person that he enlisted to help him came forward with the story. There's no estimate on the cash value of the trees, but the principal says uh, there's certainly some uh, sentimental value. The, the principal is here, Dr. Richard McCalley. He spoke to reporters a little while ago about this uh, mess here. I mean, if you drove up, you might not notice anything. You might think they were at first glance, you know, new bushes. But uh, people who are familiar with the campus certainly are seeing a, a bare scene here. And they're not happy about it. They're, they're talking about how to possibly replace it. And the principal also, by the way, told us that uh, the boy's parents uh, were not happy to hear about this, uh, as you might imagine, quite disappointed, especially so because um, Mr. Callan's mother is the uh, police chief in St. Johnsville. He's been charged with a criminal trespass and a criminal mischief, one of those, uh, a felony charge. And uh, he'll have a date in court coming up soon. The school, meanwhile, will try to figure out how to make the campus look a little more beautiful as it used to. Uh, one of the people who donated a tree here is a member of the class of 2003. And he was a substitute teacher here today. He saw this and he suggested to the current principal they possibly take some of the trees that were cut down to make a bench out of them. So some of the old trees cut down as they may be might still remain here, even as some new ones grow down the road. We're live in Gloversville, Craig Smith, CBS 6 News.